everyone, and today, um, this is Movie Maverick, and today I'm gonna be talking about something, uh, something fun, actually, actually, like, I've been thinking of doing this, so, what I want to talk about is show you guys the way I edit my videos, because, honestly, it's better to know a person by the way they edit, especially if they have a YouTube channel or, like, a big fan base. So... Basically, today I'm just going to be talking about the thumbnails and share some of the stuff I think that I put in. Because my thumbnails are quite unique from any Doctor Who review thumbnail that I make. Or any Doctor Who YouTube channel that I know or like I watch. Their thumbnails are kind of basic, although look professional. Like me, I just went for straight out jokes, puns inside the thumbnails. Looks like There's like a lot of hidden jokes in my thumbnails, a lot of hidden puns, or just a lot of hidden stuff that I like to share today because literally my thumbnails are unique. So let me just show you what I mean by that. Alright. Let's head to my, my YouTube channel. Okay. There it is. Okay, okay, okay. Let's start from my newest videos because honestly every time I do a doctor review, um, you could tell there's a theme around it. Like with Season Doom, I added a lot of plants and leaves, and yeah, I put like a unit symbol on it because the unit was in the episode. Um, yeah, I put a lot of leaves, so it, it also steam because that's how they defeat the Crinolites in the end. Although they defeat them with explosions, so that's why the fire's there. Um, okay, with my when I ranked all the Doctor seasons, um, I always thought that I could just add up a Doctor to thumbnail with the, new, the newest sequence of Doctor Who being in the background. So I was looking for a cool font to use for the lettering and I found a really cool one has that looks like when you find at a pub or like at a cool place at night. So I went for that and I went for color red for part one and color blue for part two. Uh, the end of ideas video is not one I'd like to thumbnail. I could have just had William Hartnell be like question mark, huh? Because he he's that doing that face where it kind of looks like he's asking. He's kind of confused. I could have just added him, but I feel like I don't like the addition that I added my face to the thumbnail. I feel like I just should have left it like that, and that's it. Top ten Doctor Who monsters. That one's a pretty good video. Like 24 views really good. I love the thumbnail because I can show a bunch of monsters on the thumbnail and that's why I love about whenever I do a ranking video. I can show so much stuff on the thumbnail and surprisingly they do get a lot of views but I don't feel like they deserve the views they get because here's the thing. People have done it to death by now. People have done top tens of Doctor Who forever and it's getting really old. That's why I want to try new things. So and when I do try new things it kind of does fine. Like when I shared my Doctor Who story it did pretty good. Um, or when I did a video on Star Wars and Doctor Who that didn't get a lot of views, surprisingly. I don't know. I don't get it. I mean, I have good ideas, but are they good enough? I mean, I'm, just, I, I'm making this video so I can show you guys what I mean. So, honestly, let's check the other thumbnails. Oh, yes. Planet of Evil. When I reviewed that episode, um, I wanted to get a, a thumbnail that re represented a, just a planet that's evil, so I just added red eyes and a planet. Obvious enough, I mean, yeah, look at that. Um, for the Armageddon Factor, I kind of did a really black background, considering the Black Guardian is the main villain, and two, um, it's the finale of season 16. Um, I kind of wanted to add, I mean, a lot of ridiculousness happening in my thumbnails. I mean, you can tell. Um, so yeah, I like making my thumbnails. I love editing my videos. I feel like editing is the best part, apart from making the video. So I just love editing my videos. That's what really keeps me going. I am working on a video soon, and the reason why I'm not working on it is because I get tired of it every time I work on it. So if I have the patience to work on it, I'll go back to it. And the, basically, the video I'm referring to is a, th a video. I can't tell you yet because it's a surprise. And you know, I want to get it done on September because that's, that's when this channel's birthday finally. It, when it, this is when that channel's birthday is finally like five years old. No wait, four years old. 
Yeah, the channel turns four years old next month. So I kind of want to release that video next month. Um, I mean, every time I post a, 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 thumb, a video for Doctor Who and the Action Adventures, I always do um, a thumbnail that really, I mean, I could tell you my inspiration for all this. Like, let me show you, let me show you. So, I have so much inspiration and these channels kind of help that. I mean, they, I mean, I got their inspiration for like editing, comedy, jokes, setup, any of that. Um, also because of how they, they, uh, drawn out time and, because that's one of the biggest mysteries I've talked to or any TV show. My problem is how can you have a fast paced episode and a long paced episode? in the same show. I mean, isn't that difficult to pull off? I mean, if there could be like 20 minutes long or 40 minutes long, I mean, that's crazy. And yes, the reason why we don't have a lot of episodes in TV shows, like, like, um, Doctor Who, for example, like, TV shows are now strict to like 10 episodes per season, which, and like, back then, like, just like years ago, it was, we could have actually had seasons where I had like 26 episodes, 20 episodes, but now we're just straight to 13 or 10, and that's upsetting. But the only reason why that can't happen today is because of commercials, and that they need to put their ads on the commercials so they get enough money. So honestly, the biggest problem with TV shows nowadays is that people are really greedy and that they only put ads and they don't have enough time actually doing well. That you could just post a really crappy episode of a TV show and put a lot of commercials in it. And you think, oh, it's gonna be really, really good. No, that's not how it works. So, I mean, I just wanted to share this with you guys because I couldn't, I couldn't figure out anything else to post, so I just wanted to share this, because why not? I wanna post my videos. I will do Shada in a few days, but right now, I mean, I don't know what else to do. Should I do another top 10? I want you guys to let me know in the comments if I should do another top 10. Because the last time I did doc, doc, uh, a top 10, um, which I did a month ago, two months ago I think, it took me a long time. I mean, I was sweating. Um, I mean, I could do it again, but it's probably one of those videos where I'm going to have to take a lot of time on focusing on the video. I mean, editing it itself was really... I mean, I, I think I should do top 5 next time. Because doing top 10 is a long, takes a long time. So I think I should do top 5 because it's simpler. I don't know. I mean, it's up to you guys if you want me to do a top 10 ever again. Which I'm willing to do, or just I want to know, let you know if you guys want me to. Because it's completely optional. But I don't think I should do it if, because it took a lot of time. I mean, it only took it one day, but I was, I mean, I was, I don't know, I was just working my butt off a lot, honestly. So, you know, the video I'm really proud of that that I made was naming every Doctor episode of one sitting. And yes, I can confirm everything in that video was by memory. And yeah, all the filler sounds you hear in the video, I kind of had to cut out because it was getting really annoying. But I guarantee you, there was a lot of filler sounds when I said, uh, or any of that. So I just wanted to cut it out because it was annoying, but I left some in so you can tell I was trying to remember the episodes. So yes, that proves that it was by memory, and uh, that did 35 views, which I am really proud of. And honestly, I think I'm at my peak right now. I'm, I'm thinking I'm peaking right now on my channel because I've never done this well, ever. I mean, I hope I do better. I'm getting comments, views, likes, every like five videos, it's fine, honestly. It's just that it's way better than I used to be like years ago. I mean, I started this channel in 2016. Um, back then I had like an old channel that wasn't deleted on YouTube. It got deleted because I posted a lot of videos with copyrighted music. A lot of sp I, I used to spam comments a lot. Not like spam spam, but like I used to cuss a lot in my comments. I mean, I still do, but I don't do it to people that say like... Nowadays, I know what constructive criticism means. Back then, I did not know what that means at all. So, yeah, but I think copyright, copyright, the copyright system really deleted my channel. Really, because I, I, I did not, I did not care at all. I just posted something with copyright music in it, and I just didn't care. Honestly, I just wanted to have fun on that one channel, but it got deleted in 2018 of July. 
July 8, 2018, and I've learned my lesson. I mean, the BBC will always copyright some of my videos if, but so far it hasn't been that bad, honestly. I mean, I it's called fair use, honestly. So, and uh, yeah, I think that is all. I think that's all that I have to share today. Just want to talk about it because I had a few thoughts. So these are my thoughts on how my channel's going at the moment and how everything's going for me right now. Um, yeah, uh, in a few days I will post Shada and I'll do the review. And after that, we'll have to enter the 80s era of Doctor Who, which is considered my favorite era of Doctor Who. So in late August, we'll do Leisure Hive and Shada. So see you guys later, and this is Whoever Remember, signing off.